Hey girlfriend, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Kobe. If you're not, thanks for coming back to be a part of the girlfriends. We are in a different scenery because baby, I moved. I'm in a brand new apartment. How she not gonna tell her friends she really fucking a star? She too cute to ride an Uber, so I bought her a car. They been trying to catch up with me. I'm just so I'm currently rounding off a Monday day in the life vlog. I wanna show TikTok and you guys both of some of the packages I got. I worked with the brand Lumia before. They're, they're a loungewear cozy pajama brand and they just sent me some more stuff because we're working together again. I've been tracking this package literally like a hawk. I picked it out so I already know what I got. This is the soft model rib bodysuit. I got it in the size small in the color Sincere White. It feels so good and it's thick even though it's ribbed it's like a thick like heavy material um i wish it was a thong bottom but super cute either way and then this is a washable sleep mask it's a silk sleep mask i've been wanting one of these oh this is super cute and then these are the organic pima wide leg pants these are what i wanted the most they're so cute i'm gonna try them on but I'll put the links down to this stuff in the description box the bodysuit and these are the pants these pants i'm obsessed with they fit perfectly they're super wide leg like i'm obsessed with them and then the bodysuit definitely a really good white bodysuit to have it is pricey but i personally think that you pay for good quality and so i wouldn't have worked with them again if i didn't love the first thing that i had i'm about to live in these pants y'all gonna see this all the time thanks for joining me for another daily vlog bye guys okay i'm hungry moved august 4th from my old place into my new place and i absolutely love it it's stunning i moved this mirror i moved this mirror to right here right when you walk in right next to my desk speaking of my desk we have a life update that we're gonna have to do in a separate video there have been some life changes i'm at peace with them i'm happy about them it's a new era like i've been saying about this apartment it's a new era it's my sophisticated bachelorette hosting almost in my 30s era today is monday august 21st um i've been going like crazy i've been working all day i've been running errands so yeah i'm going to finish answering some emails and then i'm going to eat dinner and go to bed so i will talk to you guys tomorrow bye happy tuesday hope you guys enjoyed that little montage -y morning routine i have got 
somewhat of a busy day today. Um, I have an interview at 11.30 that I'm currently getting ready for. After my interview, I'm going to make me some breakfast and then um, make my greens juice for the week. And then I have some footage that I need to reshoot for a brand that I'm working with. Answer some emails and then I'm gonna go to the gym. So a lot has happened since I moved. I'm still in Dallas, but I moved to another part of Dallas. It's almost football season, which means I will be traveling quite a bit. And then my family has season tickets to the Titans games um, in Nashville. And so I go through the schedule once it's released every year and tell my dad which games I'm coming back for so that he doesn't sell the tickets or give them away. So my apartment is slightly smaller. I think I mentioned this in my last YouTube video. It's slightly smaller. It's about 50 square feet smaller, but the layout is completely different. So it makes it, and there's so much more like natural light. So it makes it look like it's bigger which I absolutely love. But that means I have no extraterrestrial storage. Well, looks like I'm going back to my old apartment today. I got this new Lancome primer, so we're gonna try it. It's a priming serum, 24 hour hydrating solid smoothing primer with hyaluronic acid, niacinamide. Look at the packaging, it's so cute. Opens like that and has a mirror and then it has a little spatula. I love these things and then opens up this way and then you take this little paper off I like it so far I dermaplaned my face the other day so I really want to perm my eyebrows really bad <laughs> Like laminate them so bad. So my eczema is coming back in tenfold. It's coming back on my eyelids and around my eyes. And it used to not be like that. So you may see like my eyes are a little darker, which I'm gonna be very insecure about. Um, Cause I've just prided myself on really taking really good care of my skin. But like with my eczema, I literally can't do anything about that. Like I just have to um, use the products that I have to tame it, but like, doesn't make it fully go away or like never come back. Even though the products that I use are really good and like I swear by La Roche Posay, I talk about it all the time, especially when it comes to my eczema. Like it's not gonna completely make it go away or never make it come back again, which is annoying. There's like different things that make my eczema flare up. Yeah, I just have to deal with it. Lancome really did their big one with this Tonti Doll mascara and the, I think it's called Sil XL Booster. Those two combined perfection. So it's a little bit later in the day. I am currently on my way to get something to eat. My interview went great. And then I'm going to go back to my old apartment, pick up my packages, and then come back to the house, edit and answer some video, answer some videos, edit and answer some emails. Listen, with this new era in my life, I have to have a to-do list every single day or else my brain will be scattered. I have so much I'm trying to do, so much I want to do. It'll just be scatterbrained. This is the one time, well there's a few times, when I have to take out the trash, that's another time. But this is one of the times that I wish I had a man because having to put air in my tires, which I just think it's time um, for me to get new tires, but like my dad usually tells me, I know what it looks like when I need new tires, but my dad usually tells me, hey, it's time to get new tires. And I know I need air in them, but like I'm a lady that still kind of believes a little bit in gender roles to a certain extent. And I fully believe that women should not have to take out the trash or put air in their tires. And even if it's not a gender role thing, it's something that I don't want to do. So you can tussle with that how you want to in the comments. <laughs> oh, don't pull out in front of me. You com quad. People love to pull out in front of you in Dallas, baby, and go very mediocrely slow. I love seeing the Maybach SUVs. Like, y'all know y'all sexy. It's like you see a man, you be like, you, you know you fat. I just got to my old apartment. It'd be weird over here. There was a girl sitting in the leasing office about to take a tour and I wanted to tell her so bad, girl, don't do it. But you know, people gotta figure out what works for them. What worked for me may work, may not work for her and vice versa. The package I got was from Bondi Sands. 
the tanning company. But this is the Technicolor One Hour Express Tan. It's four of them. So this is what it comes in. Sapphires for natural cool tone. Emerald is the all the deep olive tone. I was gonna say Magneta. Magneta. Magenta is for the rich deep tone and caramel is for warm golden tone. So I may try the caramel one maybe this weekend. The way that we're driving on the expressway on the way here, people was driving like they had no sense. And I got good insurance, but not too much dip on your chip, babe. Back in the car again, because now I'm going to Dutch Bros. I went home, I talked to my mom, I talked on the phone, I caught up with some people. I was able to get two things done. I want a fun drink. Um, it's still hot as hell outside. So I just have on the same thing. I just put on like an actual t-shirt and took off my bodysuit. Yes, please. How's your day been? It's been going good. How's yours been? Just get off of work? Yeah. Where do you work? I work myself. I'm a content creator. Yeah, so I do like vlogging on TikTok and YouTube and stuff. So, yeah, I love it. Perfect. Thank you. Have a good night. That was the very first time I've ever told someone that and like not been like cringe about it. I get like nervy sauce to tell people that like that's my job i don't know why snow allegra i love her i could listen to her sing all the time i get a medium ice galaxy fish which i think is strawberry and passion fruit um with red bull so it's red bull in here and then i get them to add peach because i'm addicted to anything peach i set some content live but i didn't get to edit anything else but we we're going to the gym i i got my pre-workout i got my water we're going to the gym and I'm gonna do full body, which isn't my favorite anymore, which I, I used to love doing full body. Like I would do full body every single day and not do targeted days. And this is what I'm wearing, super basic. I have on my Amazon shorts that I wear all the time. I have on a sports bra from Amazon as well. A regular, just like old college t-shirt. My favorite Nikes, which one day I will upgrade them to a different pair. And then my Beyonce sweatshirt. Never been a people person, always been a people's person. Know how to get a person, don't know how to keep a person. Yeah, but you know everybody needs somebody. And everybody ain't gonna be somebody. I mean, it's been like 20 years since my mother has seen somebody. I'm convinced that she thinks that it's too late or something. I should try and set up. So while I was working out, I got a really big urge to get in and out for dinner, even though it's 10 o'clock, but that's my normal dinner time. And that's perfect because I didn't thaw anything out to cook. And so I am going to hop in the shower right fast so that I can get right back in the bed. I can get right in the bed when I come home. I wish Shake Shack was a drive-through because I'm pretty sure they're closed by right now, but there's a Shake Shack near me now. And that's really what I want. Those fries are so freaking good. in and out fries are not good. Good, how are you? Can I get a double double with no in and out sauce? Uh, yes, can I have grilled onions and no tomato? And then that'll be it. Thank you. Girl, I could barely hear you. At the one that I used to go to, they would shout. They wanted the whole world to know your order. The wind is blowing? Okay, let's be not dramatic. The wind is blowing outside. Not crazy, but the wind is blowing. But it's still 97 degrees outside and it's 10.37 at night. Make that one make sense.